Right, Mondeo TDCI goes limp mode, coil light flashing. Sometimes works for me this one. Done it a couple of times and it works. Right. There's a split pin on here, prise the slip pin off. Split pin. And then this arm will come away. Right. Can't really see that great, but this arm. Try to get some more light on there for you. Right. This arm controls the veins on the turbo. A lot of people replace this box. It's not generally this box. Because what it is is that arm gets a bit stiff. You'll be able to see when you've got it off whether you've got much play in it. And that is pretty solid. You should be able to pull it forward and back, forward and back fairly easily. Which means all the back of the veins are gunked up on the turbo. And this little electronic box pulls the turbo open and closed. And obviously when it senses its resistance, it feels it can't move it, and it sends it in limp mode. So now we've disconnected it, what I generally do, is if I'm using it for me personal use, just disconnect them, and just literally undo that bolt there and tie it to that bolt. So this is out of the way, and then this, this arm's free to move, and the computer's happy, because it thinks there's not a problem. So, with that disconnected, Now start it up, and we have no glow plug light, and that'll drive fine, that won't go limb mode anymore. So yes, in a way, it's that turbo box. But in another way, it's not the turbo box. It's just that little arm. So, give it a go. Might work for you, might not. And if you don't want to, you can always just whack it back and put it back on and then that'll work but anyway might help someone out it's worked on a couple but say if you're going out buying a box first you know it's probably the back of the veins on the turbo give, try to give them a clean out what it generally is is the ones on the back that you can't get to so there's a few other videos on there how you can clean it that's up to you if you want to or whatever but good luck